Hi. Welcome to the Wix website builder. I'm going to explain to you about pin to screen, how to pinning an element, and how to pinning large elements. At the beginning I will show you how the site looks like. In the upper right corner we click on preview. Now we can see how the web pages would look like they would be posted on the web. When I scroll the page, we see that the main menu is at the top of the site and is visible when I scroll page. Returning to the editor page, click in the top right corner to back to editor. Pinning an item to your screen means that it is always visible at the side of your user's screens when they are viewing your site. You can pin most elements in your editor. The feature is especially useful for pinning social tools, menus and contact forms, so that they are easily accessible at all times. In the upper part of the page we have a contact form. We'll pin it now. Select an object, right click, and in the drop down menu, click pin to screen. You will open a small window in which you can adjust where your element will be located. Fields, up, down, left, right, etc. are displayed. When you select a position, you can more precisely locate the place where it will be with the help of the sliders along the horizontal and vertical axis. More precisely, you can determine the position by typing the number that determines the pixels left or right from the starting position. When you set everything up, just close the window. We'll go back to preview. When I scrolled the page, I saw that our contact form was in the position we determined. We will return to the page and repeat the process with the social network icons. I select icons, right click, pin to screen, set the position we want. I'll enter the number. Close the window. When I'm on the editor's page, when I scroll also pinned elements. We go to preview and see that everything is set up properly. Not all elements have this option. For example, this large background image does not have pin to screen. You can pin the elements of any size to the sides of your screen, however, we advise you to be careful about the size of the elements you are pinning. Be aware that pinning large elements can block large areas of your site and your visitors will not be able to see your site content. I'll pin this picture to try. It's too big and bothered. You can use unpin and turn off the pin option from the element. Right click on the element in the drop down menu, click pin settings. In the upper part of the window there is an active text unpin this element. When clicking on this element, it is no longer pinned. The next option I'll show you is pinning on all pages. Select some pinned items and go to the right click. The last option in the drop down menu is show on all pages. When the switch is turned on, the element will be pinned on all pages of the site. I'm going to switch page on the site to check. Pinned elements stand and when I scroll the page. We are going back to the home page. Pinned elements are not pinned on your mobile site. When the element is pinned and when you select it, a small green pin is displayed, this is a shortcut that can be used for pin settings. Thanks for watching the video, I hope it helped you.